hi everyone in this video I am going to show you how to find objects in Active Directory using two different methods so when you are logging when you're logged into your domain controller uh, you can open server manager and you want to go into tools and then you want to bring up the active directory users and computers so you can open active directory users and computers from the server manager I'm just going to close this I'm gonna close this you can also open the active directory users and computers snap in from the windows uh, start click on start menu and then click on windows administrative tools and then over here you will find all the administrative tools on your windows server uh, and you want to go into the if you have the if you have installed the if you have made your uh, windows server the domain controller you should have the active directory users and computers listed there under the administrative tools so just double click on the active directory users and computers and it opens up right here so now the next thing you want to do here is if you notice on the you want to make sure that you select your domain and you want to click on this button here which says find objects in active directory domain services again you want to make sure that your domain is selected domain name and then you want to click on this button find objects in active directory domain services and then you can type the name of the user and also make sure that you are you have selected your domain here homelab.com in my case and then you just click on find now and it will find all the users whose name starts with barb uh, I'm going to close this find user contacts and groups window or dialog box you can also right click on your homelab.com click on find and then type barb here click on find now and then the same result shows up we have two users whose name starts with barb so that's one way of finding the uh, user or a user in your active directory environment now you can also create queries you can save them you know so what you want to do is right now as you, as we can see there are no saved queries so in order to create a query that you can always use it uh, right click on the saved queries folder choose new and then go to query over here uh, you wanna type let's say that you wanna create a, a query where you can find you, can, you, can, you wanna see all the users in your homelab.com domain or active directory domain so let's just name your query all users and then for the descriptions you can just say users for the entire domain and the query root uh, should be your domain home lab and then you want to click on define query and then where it says define the variables under the users because we're doing it uh, we're trying to find the all the users in our domain active active directory domain so we want to make sure that uh, the we are under the users tab here under where it says define the variables for your query F in in front of the name column uh, name label you wanna uh, make sure you select this value has a value and then you just wanna click OK and then you wanna click OK here again and as soon as we clicked OK, you would see that these are all the users so far in my Active Directory. All the users. And next time when, when you close this, you go back here. And then 
you can just click on all users to see all the users in your active directory domain okay thank you